guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh, hey, if you guys are familiar, this is my little golden doodle Duncan, and he is probably gonna make several appearances in this weekly update video. I'm so excited to kind of chat with you guys about how this past week has gone for my pregnancy. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, I do week by week pregnancy updates right here on my channel. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button. It just takes like one little click, hit the subscribe button. I wanna make sure that you don't miss out on any future videos. Every week in these videos, I do a weekly pregnancy update to update you in terms of any symptoms or cravings or what I've been up to this week in terms of baby progress, getting closer and closer to actually seeing our little baby, which we now know is a boy. So this week, one of the things that I actually noticed has to do with Duncan. He has been like extra lovey this week. It is so weird. I work from home. So every single day he's about tall enough that when I'm sitting at my chair, he can just plop his head down either on my lap or kind of my little grow and bump action here. Do dogs just like sense whenever a little baby is growing or something? I don't know. I think it's the craziest thing ever. So this week, Duncan has definitely been an extra love. And as you can see in this video, he, like I said, he might be here for the entire video. So if you see a tail wag, you know who it is. We are here at our uh, giant store. <laughs> and what are we here for? We're here to pick up this week's baby food item. Hey, Duncan, say hello. We spent most of today going around shopping for an upcoming trip, kind of just using some gift cards from Christmas, buying some next size up clothes for me. <laughs> and me, yay! So now the day's about over and we wanted to make sure we picked up our baby food item. Again, similar to a couple weeks ago, we're not sure if they actually have this in the store. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. What the heck? I think it's like smaller than this. What the heck is this? I don't know what we're about to make with this. I use my little shopping trip to get some better clothing and clothing that just fit better for active wear and just every day. And so I got some of these t-shirts. These are from Target. These are just short sleeve t-shirts, but they all are in like the next size up, which is super weird to like be getting things in another size. This is a large, I got like this. I got a camo one, I might get several more. And then I got some super cute active wear. I went to two of my favorite spots, Target, and I went to Old Navy and I wanna show you what I got. So Old Navy is usually the place that I get almost all of my active wear. I feel like it's super affordable. Whether you're pregnant or not, you definitely need to go there. This is my favorite sports bra that they have. Basically, it is just a Y back with some straps in the back and the front is super basic, but I have this sports bra and I think every single color that they have. I just got this blue one. This is a new color that I just saw this week. So I was like, I need it. So I got this in a size large. I also got it in gray. I also got some of their um, short sleeve shirts. Little basic shirts. These are actually mediums. These still fit. They're still flowy and just more comfortable than a lot of my tank tops that I have. So I got this sports bra. This is a Joy Lab sports bra. Again, it's kind of just like strappy in the back. Simple um, v-neck in the front. Nine dollars. I got these pair of leggings, which again, are they Joy Lab? No, these are all in motion. I think this is just like the Target brand. And so these are their contour leggings. Guys, how cute are these? I got these in a size large so that I can kind of like grow with them. They fit me now, they're a little bit loose. Should I do a little try on session? This is that old navy top. I have it in this color, I have it in a pink color. These are those all in motion contour high power waist leggings. Then I have on that $9 black sports bra. I don't know if you can see. Oh, is this a bump shot? Is this like a weekly bump shot? Here's the bump this week. It's literally growing so fast. It just feels so much better to have leggings that like aren't cutting off my circulation. I just feel so much better. Week 21. Week 21, get at me. Ah! Hey, what is that, by the way? It's endive. So last week it was a banana. Our baby is shrinking. I think the grocery store just didn't have the right size of this, but we wanted to buy it anyways to show you that we got it. We got a couple things that look similar that we thought we could actually eat. Yum. This is what I thought it would look like, like a bigger, leafier, lettuce -y looking thing. And we I got, got this. <laughs> I got this. This is the size of our child. This is what it's called. This is what I thought it would maybe be like. But this is what it's like in my head. <laughs> A titan. When we think of lettuce, we try to figure out what we're gonna do with it. We were like, salad, boring. Boring! So we didn't wanna make a salad. I'm not a diet, so I don't really eat salad and like And then, that. again, I think these endive leaves are just be like crisp that you can like actually like put something in a little boat or like a little wrap. So, got these thinking we could like rip them off mm -hmm. and like put something in it and then eat it. Same with this. What about? P.F. Chang's Chicken Lettuce Wraps. This weekend we hung out with some friends who actually have a 10 month old little girl and they were like, what has the hardest part been so far? And I feel like I've had a 
pretty easy going pregnancy I should say I feel like I've been very blessed and things have been going a-okay for the majority of my pregnancy I feel like the hardest part has honestly been not having caffeine all day long literally named my dog after Dunkin Donuts coffee because I love it so much on a normal day I might have a cup of coffee in the morning maybe like midday if I start to like get a little bit of you know drain or I feel like I'm starting to crash a little bit and with pregnancy my doctor specifically said to keep caffeine intake under 200 milligrams it's honestly for most days I keep it at 100 or lower any of you guys that follow me over on Instagram if you don't already please go ahead and follow me over there I share a lot of my daily life over there and like just the day-to-day -day updates but every single morning I work out it's part of my routine I like to be active I work out from home and I actually use an all-natural pre-workout that has about 100 milligrams of caffeine in it and I use that every single morning my doctor gave me the a-ok -okay on that pre-workout that's usually the only little source of caffeine that I get for the entire day I know that I could have another cup of coffee I know that I could have some decaf although I realize that there's actually caffeine in decaf too who knew I have found that that caffeine intake has been one of the hardest parts that I can no longer lean on during this pregnancy and it's super hard especially on those weeks when I am feeling more fatigued you uh making me dinner this is my dinner recipe mm. and by my dinner recipe i googled a recipe mm. and i'm now not following it i'm just winging it my favorite favorite thing is when you wing it so for the sauce i thought it was just soy sauce it's like soy sauce rice vinegar sesame oil all these fancy things that i don't have so i'm gonna do a quarter of a cup of soy sauce and then maybe like a tablespoon or so um, maple syrup to like sweeten it up a little bit and that's what we're gonna use for the sauce. And it's gonna be great. With the two things that you were that were supposed to go into it, sesame oil and what else? Rice vinegar. And instead you put in what? Maybe. That's, oh, that's why I love you. That's why I love you. So the recipe called for minced garlic? It called for garlic. I don't know if it's minced or ground. It's not important. Okay. So putting it in, we're gonna use mince. A scoop of this chopped ginger I did. See? It smells like it's gonna be good. Whenever you try this at home or hi, husband, you're gonna like it. Next up, we take all of this and we just throw it just in throw the it chicken. In. Just throw I it all in. the ground chicken. Okay. Dump this sauce on top. Pour it out. This is the ground chicken that I already kind of cooked up. Got a baby bump there. Baby bump going. You can't really see it, you know, from the front. Hi, from the side, maybe. And I'm gonna add some of this ginger that I cut up and some of these water chestnuts. I don't think you should zoom in. Another key ingredient. <laughs> What's the key ingredient? You're supposed to garnish with a little green onion. We're gonna garnish with. Who needs garnish? Sauce going in. Sauce is going in. Ooh. Oh, it looks good. Honestly, though, I do like your baking. Your baking is great. Oh, hello. You may call me your majesty. I got these taco holders. I'm gonna see if this makes sense. This is our finished chicken lettuce wrap mixture. It looks great, it smells great. All right, we got our chicken lettuce wraps. They actually look pretty good, aside from me like spilling the sauce everywhere. <laughs> Size our baby. Taste test time. You just want me to bite into it? Or yeah, we're gonna bite into it. Little baby lettuce wraps. And then Emmanuel has the big boys. Ready? One, two, two three. three. Oh. It's very good. It's good. It's good. The ginger? Ooh. Maple. Fresh ginger, I and think, the, was the move. And the maple syrup? Yeah. It's good. This is like P.F. Chang's. I need like 10 of these. All right, guys, that is the end of our week 21 pregnancy update video. Thank you for following along with myself and the Duncan boy. If you liked this video, make sure that you hit subscribe, hit that like button so that you get notifications every single week when I share my weekly pregnancy update videos and also when we drop other videos right here on this channel. Again, feel free to follow me over on Instagram for daily life updates and I will be back with you guys next week. Mom, baby has made me dinner. Dinner, 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 dinner. P.F. Chang's, I'm accepting uh, sponsorships. If you guys want to give me a lifetime supply of lettuce wraps or really anything on your menu I'm good with. Like, I love your orange chicken. It's, it's phenomenal. Just get at me. My phone number, I'm going to leave it in the description. Or you could just, you know, look me up on Facebook or DM me, you know, slide in my DMs. <laughs> <laughs> don't, you guys don't say that. The kids don't say that. Hey, yo, look me up on TikTok. You're not. All the kids are doing it. Look at my dance moves. If I get on TikTok, would I want to dance though?